let's say for example that you want to issue a command that holds uh, until you say stop. So in Star Citizen they've got a new landing system. You press and hold the N key uh, and that takes you into an auto landing as long as you're within range. Uh, let's look at how a command like that might. So we're going to call this automatic landing. All right, and we're going to do a key press, and we're just going to press the key um, and get it started. Now, um, we'll call this um, auto land, put it in the landing category. So, because we're just pressing the key, we're going to need to do a second piece, which is, you know, stop of uh, this command. So, there's a few things we want to do first. First of all, I want to create a boolean flag, right? And I'm going to call this holding, and I'm going to set it to true. So we know that we are holding something uh, that needs to be stopped. So boolean, true, good. Um, so we'll press down that N key, and then we're also, uh, I think that's good for right now. Uh, we're going to have a new command. And we're just, this is going to be based on when you say stop. We're going to say, first of all, we're going to build a condition, right? So, if holding has not been set, then we're going to have um, exit the command, right? So if we're not holding anything and we say stop, we don't need to do anything. That's fine. So at the very beginning, if the holding flag isn't there, we're going to exit. Now we can go ahead and once we're in there, start comparing. So a conditional statement. If holding equals true, right, then we can have voice attack execute another command, right? We could do one of these, or we could have voice attack stop another command. Uh, that's useful in some cases. Now, in this case, we're still going to be pressing that key. So what we need to do is actually put in another key press. So we're going to say the N key, but this time we're going to release it, right? So we're good there. And that should be everything we need, but we're going to go back through and make sure uh, we're going to stop this other command, automatic landing, and then release the key. So hit OK. Now the reason we're going to do that, first of all, is because on the auto landing, let's build in a pause, right? So after 30 seconds here, then we're going to actually release. And what might be better is instead of 30 seconds, let's do in like two second increments. All right, so we'll get that. But we're going to do that in a loop. All right, so loop start. Integer loop greater than zero. Now, part of the problem here is I want to make sure uh, after about two seconds, that's when voice attack puts the pause command in there. I'm going to write something every two seconds into the event log, and I'll do that at a two second frequency. So I'll just put holding. So we know every two seconds we'll get a new holding in there, and then we'll set the loop integer ahead of that. So let's do it for 15. That'll give us a 30 second cutoff. All right. We'll do that outside here. And then again, as we have loop, we're going to subtract one each time it loops. Okay. So now we're going to set the NK, uh, we'll press it. We're going to set the boolean flag for holding to true. And then we're going to loop 15 times where we pause, write to the event log, 
and then loop. And then at the end, we are instead then going to release the key. This is kind of our 30 second failsafe, and I'll include that as well. So in red here, save for holding event reached. Now it's important to do this because if you forget to say stop, those keys are just going to be stuck down the entire time. You'll have to, you know, figure out what's wrong with your keyboard. Something will seem weird. Um, don't want to deal with that. So uh, you put in a failsafe there just to make sure. And just for demonstration purposes, instead of 30 seconds, I'm going to do it like eight seconds. So we'll have four loops. So hit OK, auto land, and then stop. And here we're making sure we kill that command. We should be good there. So let's give it a try. Automatic landing. Stop. Okay. So looks like that worked. It's it's kind of hard to tell with the uh, without the system uh, showing us all the keys that are being pressed, but that should hopefully work.